Hey guys, it's me with Thais. How are you doing today? So today I am continuing my The Clash season four journey and we are going to be watching Mary Ann Ozabel perform This Is A Man's World. Oh, yes it is. This is a good song. This is a big, big song. You got to have that jazzy voice. And then I always think of that Christina Aguilera performance where she's in that white suit and she's like flinging her head and hair around on the ground. That is what I'm comparing this song to. So let's see how she does. This is the first time I'm gonna be seeing her perform. Hopefully she does well. Also, I don't know what happens with copyright, but some of these performances get blocked and then some of these performances don't have any claims on them at all. So if one video is not blurred and then another video is, it's just because one video got a copyright claim and the other one doesn't. And like the copyright claims aren't just like oh, demonetized, which I don't really care if that happens, but when they get fully blocked, there's like nothing I can do and I have to blur them. So just a heads up, if you see that in the future, that is why some are blurred and some are not blurred. Anyways, let's get on with this performance. Here we go. This is a man's world. She's wearing the white suit well it's not a white suit it's a white dress but that reminds me immediately of christina this is a man's world this is a man's world Ooh. you see <laughs> yeah, flip that hair. I wish I had hair to flip it, but ooh. To take us over the road. She kind of reminds me a little bit of Fritzy from last season. That kind of attitude. Man made the trains to carry the heavy load. Man the Oh, I loved it. She had me from the hair flip. I was invested. And then she continued her voice supported the sass. You know, it's one thing to have the sass, but then if you don't have like the voice or the talent to back it up, then it's kind of awkward to watch. Like, could you imagine if she's like doing this and like this, but then she sounded bad? Like that would just be very uncomfortable. It's so satisfying when the voice matches the attitude and the look. She was gorgeous. I loved her hair. I loved her makeup. I loved the little white dress. I'm a fan. I can't wait to see what she does next. I hope she continues this sassy journey, this attitude. Fritzy, she had that attitude and I always wanted to see her performances because she was so entertaining. You wanted to see what she was going to do with her face, with her mouth, and with her movements. And I get the same feeling with Miss Marianne Osbell. I think she'd be good at like an Aretha song or like a Natalie Cole or like a Donna Summer song, like ooh, like Bad Girls. I mean, that's not really a big vocal moment song, but it has that attitude. And sometimes you don't really need big vocals if you have the performance to back it up. So I'm excited to see what else she's got down the road. Thank you guys for watching and I will see you all later. Bye.